Ladies and gentlemen, that was Bioshock. That was, uh, that wasn't too bad. Um, I know a lot of people gave this game a hard time. But I'll be honest with you, it's actually not that bad. Um, I mean, there are things that annoyed me a little bit more with Bioshock 2. It's actually a pretty similar story to Bioshock 1 in, in a lot of ways. But I personally found that it was, it was fine. Um, yeah, maybe it's not as good, but it's not bad, per se. I'm looking forward to Bioshock Infinite. Um, I'm probably going to be playing that, um, not next, but I'm going to be playing that at one point. Um, yeah, so, um, that's, uh, that was a pretty good game. Um, I have to admit, well, the game, the game look kind of looked the same. There's nothing really changing or mind boggling between it's possible this is the remastered collection, so I don't know if there, this looked any better than the original. Um, but it did look good for the version that I played. It looked really good. Um, I'm not sure... The story... It's okay. I mean, there, there's things where I found it annoying. I found getting the... The little sisters was more annoying in this one than it was in the first one. Some would say it'd be more. it was more challenging... And that's a good thing. But I found it annoying because there's like, it wasn't even. Um, sometimes you got bombarded and sometimes you killed like five of them and then it was done. Um, it, it's really weird the way that it worked. But I have to admit um, that I, you know, this is good. Uh, I, I liked it anyways. I mean, I am taking it in hindsight. Hindsight's twenty twenty. Um, I'm playing it after the, after the fact, there's no hype around it. Um, you know, it's this, I'm playing this like really out of order. Um, a lot of people, people started playing the series when they announced it would be a Bioshock 4. Um, and yeah, so, um, I'm going to try and, and, um, and see how Bioshock Infinite is. I'm not sure what my next game is going to be. I'm going to see if it's going to be Doom Eternal. Um, we'll see how that goes. It looks like a lot of fun. I know one of my viewers, uh, one of my followers um, is playing it now, uh, Engineering Gaming Nerd. But he was like super gung-ho about it. Uh, he played Doom 6 2016 um, like a few weeks ago or a month ago. And he has been really, really like into it and... Uh, he's, he got really back into the lore. Um, you know, the way I look at Doom, Doom Eternal is, it's the 80s, ver it's the, the today version of 80s movies. It's just in your face action. Storyline takes a back burner and nobody really gives a shit about the fucking story, really, quite honestly. Uh, but hey, it is what it is. And, um, yeah, um. That is it for tonight. Um, hope that you guys... Um, um, thank you for everyone that passed by. This was a charity stream. I know I didn't get a lot of subs but uh, and bits, but I have to say thank you to Rush DVD for his sub subscription. Uh, really, really appreciate it. That's going to be donated to uh, a charity of my choice, HPIC. Um, and I'm really, 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 um, really, really appreciate it. Um, and I will do more of these and I'm probably going to be doing this tomorrow night as well for my retro night in Canada. Um, I don't know what I will be playing, but I will definitely be playing something retro. Um, I don't know what yet, uh, probably something, uh, um, probably will play something on my retro pie we'll see how that goes i know my retro streams usually go pretty well uh maybe i'm gonna play um something i've played a lot maybe i'll play something brand new like blades maybe i'll play blades of steel which i've played a lot maybe i'm gonna play um um i don't know what do i have i have ninja gaiden which i actually never finished i'm stuck in one particular place 
I'm I, I'm gonna finish that game one one day or another. I'm gonna finish that game. Uh, there was Paperboy. There was Mike Dyson's Punch Out, which I can play the def play the um, try and beat Mike Tyson, Super Mario One, Blaze of Steel, Double Dragon Three. I think I have uh, Legendary. I think uh, Tecmo Bowl. Since there's no sports, maybe Racket Attack. We'll see how that goes, um, and we're gonna and I'm gonna play it. And we'll see how that goes. But it definitely will be a retro stream. Uh, it will be a charity stream again. Um, and again, I want to enforce. Um, you guys don't have to donate. You guys don't have to give. But try and, and support. And, and, vol and, you know, if you can't volunteer, try and support local businesses. Um, anything that will support uh, people um, in this time of crisis. Yes, there's always stupid idiots that are going to be taking advantage of the situation. Um, and to them, I say, Pfft. however, um, I think it's worth it to help out in this time. Um, yes, we're all getting, you know, it's only been a week here in Montreal, um, or in Quebec or in Canada for that matter, where there's kind of been a lockdown. Um, but it's not, um, it's, it, you know, it's only a week. We're going to get cabin fever. We are, some people are already getting cabin fever. Um, go outside, take a walk, obviously not with too many people, um, or somebody from your household, take a walk, take a, uh, deep, deep breaths, enjoy the fresh air. Um, you, you need the sun, you need to go into the sun and you need some, some, some new air to, to, uh, feel better. And, um, I really, really appreciate, um, I, I uh, really appreciate going I, this week. I, I really appreciate having a dog because it forced me to go for a walk. Very often I went, took him for many more walks than normal because we just wanted to get out of the house. Um, and I've always been used to um, uh, working from home. However, it's different when you're working from home and somebody tells you you can't go out. It's really, really weird. Anyways, um, so that's it in a nutshell. Um, if you guys want to read my review, my last review is Guns, Gore, and Cannoli 2. Uh, I had reviewed Guns, Gore, and Cannoli at the beginning of February. So now it's the next one in line. Um, I didn't put it in my, on my chat because I wanted to make sure that um, I have the donation page. However, which didn't really pop up very often, which is weird. Um, I'm going to have to look into that. Uh, but it's going to be the same thing tomorrow. Um, I'm going to be doing probably some kind of retro stream, um, as I mentioned before. Um, I'm, I actually got some retro games for free on GOG. They're actually giving out games for free, some retro games. So I got Jill of the Jungle and I got Postal, the first Postal. Uh, so I, I, I'm going to play that at one point. Maybe I'm going to start... Um, the police quest three i tried to start i did try to do police quest four however it was too cumbersome to go back and do what i needed to do so and um yeah so that's it all right guys have a wonderful evening stay safe um keep in touch with those you love um you don't we don't know how this is gonna live uh, is going to last um, I know we're all a little bit worried. Uh, we're all worried about our families. We're seeing the number of cases going up. Um, and there's kind of horror stories going in, in the, without any context, mind you. But, you know, people that are like, oh, 39, healthy, and they died without getting the results back, and they were tested. So that's kind of worrisome. Um, and I know a lot of people can panic. The fact that people are saying that, oh, I'm young, I'm not going to get sick. Um, to me, it's, it's, it's not even a question. Um, so be safe out there. Um, come back again, uh, tomorrow or this week when I'm going to be streaming some kind of new game. Um, yeah, so I'm going to probably, I'll, I'll see if I'm going to get Doom Eternal. The last time I did a poll, this had one, Bioshock 2 had one, but second place was Doom Eternal. 
Um, I just don't know if I want to dish out 60 bucks for, or 79 or 80 bucks actually Canadian, uh, for Doom Eternal. Um, I'm kind of not really liking how Bethesda is right now. Um, but we'll see how it goes and, um, yeah, have a good one guys and take care. Ciao.